Right, some people who live in Columbia tell WIS TV about a homeowners association they're calling problematic. Our Andrew Fancher spoke with these community members and has more on what's going on. Homeowners living within the Brookhaven HOA are citing major frustrations over the management of their neighborhood. It came to peak in the annual HOA meeting on Saturday when some homeowners were denied entry by a security force that we're told was paid with HOA money. You have a line outside. This was the scene at yesterday's Brookhaven Community HOA meeting, hosted annually at the Richland County Recreation Center. Homeowners being turned away and denied entry during an election of two new board members. Come Sunday, over 30 residents met at the Brookhaven Community Line to voice their concerns with WIS. Taryn Rowe, a former Brookhaven HOA board member. We need a change in the whole, the whole spectrum from the president to the board. The board would not stand up to the president, so I feel like both of them, all, all of them need to be removed from, from position and a whole new board need to be elected. Henry Cosby, who's lived in the community for 14 years, he says he hasn't received a financial statement in three years. Right now, this association has probably collected well over $100,000, if, if I had to guess, well over $100,000 in fines from these residents, and we know not where this money is going. It's just disappearing. Nobody's seen it. Nobody knows what it's being used for. I mean, it's just, it's just not right. A homeowner already has an attorney who tells WIS she proudly stands with the Brookhaven community. We reached out to the HOA president who said she wouldn't be able to speak with WIS until she hears from the association's attorney. Reporting in the studio, Andrew Fancher, WIS News 10.